Hi, Acadian. I'm Dave Baker. It's December 14th, and here's the latest stories making headlines today. Right now, the first shipments of the COVID-19 vaccine are making their way to distribution sites across the United States. The first two shots of the Pfizer vaccine are expected to be given to healthcare workers or nursing home residents later today. The rollout comes as the nationwide death toll approaches 300,000. Happening today, presidential, presidential electors will meet to decide the 2020 presidential election. Today's the day set by law for the Electoral College to cast its votes. The results will be sent to Washington, where the new Congress will tally the votes during a joint session on January the 6th. Here in Louisiana, those state eight, uh, the state's eight electors will meet in the Senate chamber of the state capitol at 1130. Those electors will cast their votes for President Donald Trump, who carried the Louisiana popular vote. If one of the electors doesn't show up, an alternate will be selected. Happening today, crews will begin closing the Bayou Shen floodgate. This will allow large barges and equipment to come into the area for the next phase of floodgate construction. The floodgates will close nightly from 7 p.m. to 7 a.m. through December the 23rd. And Louisiana DOTD estimates it will finish moving debris left on state roadways from Hurricanes Laura and Delta by the end of next month. The agency says debris collection for portions of Allen, Jeff Davis and Beauregard should be completed next week, while parts of Calcasieu and Cameron will be done by January 31st. Contractors have removed nearly one and a half million cubic yards of debris from state maintained routes so far. A quick reminder, Noel Acadiano Village will be closed for the next three days. Acadian Village says they're shutting down the light show to give their volunteers some time to rest and recharge. If you'd like to volunteer, we have details on how to sign up at KTC.com. Well, we've got temperatures that are going to push their way up to about 50 degrees by the end of the day today. Lows going to be dropping down to about 38. Stays cloudy out there through the day today. Wind chill is going to be down in the low 40s. Uh, winds kind of blowing in from the north. Quite gusty out there throughout the course of the day today. Out of the north at about 15, 20 miles an hour, gusting up to about 25 to 30. Now, late this afternoon, late this evening, you could see a little bit of clearing out there. It's going to allow the temperatures to drop down to about 38 by tomorrow. But we've got more clouds that are going to be on the way for Tuesday and a couple showers going to be in the mix on Tuesday as well. Temperature wise, be sitting in the upper 50s, 40s as we go through Tuesday night on into Wednesday. From there, clouds will slowly clear through the remainder of the work week.